Hello, lovely little Ted. So good to see you again. And guess where I am? That's right, I'm in church this morning. And it feels a bit lonely not having you all here with me, but I'm sure I'll be able to feel you singing and dancing along with me at home. Now, have you got your soft toy with you? You have, show me, show me. Oh, you've chosen some lovely soft toys this morning. Now, can you spot some friends that I found running around church and causing quite a lot of commotion? <laughs> right, I managed to round up all the little Teds and bring them to join in with us this morning, didn't I? You were all promising to be good. They say yes. I also have brought with me Big Ted. And you're gonna be good too, aren't you, Big Ted? You are fantastic. Now, can you remember our first song? It's, it's been a while, hasn't it? That's right, our God is a great big God. Are you ready? Get into a good space for dancing. Our God is a great big God. Our God is a great big God. Our God is a great big God and he holds us in his hands. He's higher than a skyscraper and he's deeper than a submarine. He's wider than the universe and beyond my wildest dreams. And he's known me and he's loved me since before the world began. How wonderful to be a part of God's amazing plan. Our God is a great big God. Our God is a great big God. Our God is a great big God and he holds us in his hands. Fantastic, great remembering. Whoa, my voice needs to warm up a bit more, I think. <laughs> now, can you find your nose? Find your nose, boop, 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 boop. How about your toes? You can't see me, but I am touching my toes, I promise. What about your ear? Be very careful. Whoop, there's my ear and there's the other one. How about your hair? That's right, be gentle. Can you find someone in your family's hair or your Teddy's hair? I mean, Ted's got hair all over him, hasn't he? <laughs> and what about your tummies? God's so special, I can see. He made me so carefully. I can reach and touch my toes, touch my tummy and my nose. God's so special, I can see. He made me so carefully from my head where my hair grows. God made me down to my toes. God's so special, I can see. He made me so carefully. I can reach and touch my toes, touch my tummy and my nose. God's so special, I can see. He made me so carefully for my head where my hair grows. God made me down to my toes. Fantastic. Great job, everyone. Now, this week at all, have you done any jumping? You have. Show me how high you can jump. <gasps> That's incredibly high. Have you done some dancing. We're always dancing in my house. Maybe a bit less now that school's back, but good dancing everyone. Show me your moves. What's your best move? I think this might be my best move. <laughs> Fantastic. And have you done any cuddling? Oh, we've done lots of cuddling over the last few weeks in our house. That's great. Give your teddy a good cuddle. That's right. Um, and have you done any clapping. It's that time again. Brilliant clapping. Clapping for God, clapping for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Clapping for God, clapping for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Some dancing, I think now. Dancing, Ted? Yeah. Dancing for God, dancing for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. 
Dancing for God, dancing for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. How about some jumping? Go as high as you can. Don't touch the ceiling. Jumping for God, jumping for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Jumping for God, jumping for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. How about some twirling? Be careful. Ready? Let's go. Twirling for God, twirling for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Twirling for God, twirling for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Now some cuddling. Find someone, give him a good cuddle. Cuddling for God, cuddling for God. It's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Cuddling for God. Cuddling for God, it's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Now some sleeping. Sleeping for God, sleeping for God, it's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Sleeping for God, sleeping for God, it's what I like to do, so I'm doing it for you. Would you like to listen to a story? You would. Come on then, come close. Not too close, not too close. Now we're going to carry on reading stories from our beginner's Bible. This half turn, sorry, there is a butterfly flying around in here. That's a bit special, isn't it? And this half turn, we are going to be talking about people who loved God and trusted God. And today we're going to start with a story about Abraham. Now, can you say Abraham? That's fantastic. Abraham, that's right. He was a man who lived a long, 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 long time ago. He trusted God to look after him. He followed what God asked him to do. So we're going to start with him and a story you might not have heard called The Visitors. So are you sitting comfortably? Now I need you to do some great acting for me this morning. Do you think you can do that? Great stuff. The Visitors. One hot day, Abraham was resting near his tent. He heard footsteps. Can you make some footsteps for me? Can you hear that? They're coming. Three men were standing nearby. Abraham went out to greet them. Hello. Would you like to rest in the shade? We have plenty of cool water to drink. Can I get you something to eat? Abraham told Sarah, that's his wife, about the visitors. He asked her to make a tasty meal. Now, what is your favourite tasty meal? <sighs> Sounds delicious. Do you know, I am partial to some fish and chips. Not very healthy, but I do like it. It's my favourite tasty meal. While they were eating, the three visitors shared some exciting news. So, show me your eating places. Oh my goodness, that's very exciting eating. And how about your exciting news face? This is mine. <laughs> Great job. Your wife is going to have a son, they said. Can you show me a surprised face? <gasps> it's much the same as the excited face, isn't it? Sarah heard what they said and she laughed. Can you laugh? <laughs> Thinking, I am too old. God asked Abraham, why did Sarah laugh? Anything is possible with the Lord. Sure enough, the next year, Sarah had a baby boy. Can you show me your baby? <laughs> That's lovely, being very gentle with your babies. They named him Isaac. What a lovely story. Now there's so much that we can learn from that story. But I'm going to just say, challenge you to do one thing this week. So Abraham and Sarah were really, really kind to their visitors and they looked after them. And we don't have very many visitors at the moment, but if you do have a visitor this week, I'm going to challenge you, challenge you to ask them just how are they doing? How are you today? Or give them a big smile. Show me your big smiles. Oh, that's so lovely. I would love to get a big smile from you guys or a big air kiss. Show me your big air kisses. <laughs> That's it, great job. 
we're going to be really kind to some of our visitors this week, just like Abraham and Sarah were to their visitors. Next week, we're going to find out some more about some different people that were faithful to God, that listened to God and uh, help and tried to live the way he wanted them to. Now, oh my goodness, what was that? That's <laughs> right, it's time for your shakers. Have you got a shaker? If you haven't got a shaker, that's okay. Just shake your hands. That's fine too. Okay, we're going to do some shaking now. Are you ready? Great stuff. God made my hands. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. shake. God made my hands. Shake, shake, shake. To praise him. That was fantastic. You haven't done this in a while and you did a great job. Let's go a bit faster, shall we? God made my hands shake, 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 God made my hands shake, 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 to praise him. Good job, everyone. Now we're going to go one last time really fast. We're only going to do it one more time because I'm not sure I can sing any higher. <clears throat> Let's try again. Are you ready? <gasps> God made my hands shake, 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 God made my hands shake, 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 to praise him. Really and well done, everyone. Now you're going to put your shakers very carefully down. If you've got a candle and your grown-up wants to light it, now is a great moment to. So what we're going to do is we're going to ask God to look after our friends and family this week, to take care of any visitors that we have in our house or that we meet around and about on our daily travels. So I want you to have a think. Think about somebody that you would like to say, Thank you, God, for this person. Please look after them. You got a person in mind? I think I have. <laughs> Great stuff. So we're going to light our candles and say that. We're also going to say, please, God, help us to be um, faithful to you. Help us to live in a kind way that you would like us to. Okay. Let's pray. Dear God, we thank you for the people in our lives. Today, we'd really like to say thank you for. And you can say their name here. If you want to shout it out loud, that's fine. Thank you for the people in our lives. Please look after them. Take extra special care of them, with them and help them to know how special they are to us and to you. Amen. And dear God, we're sorry when we, we don't live quite as amazingly as you want us to. Please help us to be kind. Please help us to um, look after people. Amen. Now we're going to blow the candles out. Now my candle's blown out already, so I'm just going to pretend I need a new candle for next time. Fantastic, everyone. Now I've got one notice. Imagine that, one notice. Um, over um, the next month, so until the 28th, I believe, of September, we're going to be collecting pictures of things that people are thankful for. They can be pictures or photographs, drawings, paintings, sculptures, any way you want to get creative. Um, do that for us and either email that picture or photograph in to the parish office and I'll leave a uh, email address down below in the description box um, or bring it round to church. Um, we should, the building should be open if you come round to the back to just drop something off and then go again. Um, it would be great so that we can do a big display in one of our windows um, to show all the things that people are thankful for as it comes up to harvest. Yes, I know harvest <laughs> so if you'd like to join in with that please do it would be wonderful to have some pictures um, that you've created little Ted's now how are your jumping legs feeling they're feeling fantastic whoa up on your feet then are we ready jump 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 for joy jump 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 for joy Jesus joy is jumping joy jump 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 for joy 
Jump, 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 jump for joy. Jump, 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 jump for joy. Jesus, joy is jumping joy. Jump, 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 jump for joy. Last time. Jump, 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 jump for joy. Jump, 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 jump for joy. Jesus, joy is jumping joy. Jump, 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 jump for joy. Yes, well done, little Ted. So lovely to be back again. And I'll see you next week. Bye.